Yo, what's up everybody? So today's review is on Taken. So Liam Neeson is playing Brian Mills, who's an ex-CIA agent, and he's going after the people who's kidnapped his daughter in France. This movie was fucking awesome. Liam Neeson was like 60 when he did this movie, and after that he became this big ass action star at that age. Like when we first see Brian, you see that he's very detail oriented he has a good relationship with his daughter, and of course the ex-wife can't stand him and whatnot. But then there's a scene where we see that he can really handle himself at a bodyguard gig. It's like that quick moment, it's like, okay, wow. This dude has skills. Like, let's see where let's, let's see where this gets us. But when his daughter finally gets taken, like oh my god, the action the action is nonstop. Like the stuff that he does. I mean, hand to hand combat, driving, you know, shooting. I mean, hell, he he disguises himself as this. He plays that. He does this. It's like, homie, in this what ninety five minute movie was doing so much. I mean, oh my god, like Brian Mills, the character was, was just fantastic. It's like I see why they did the TV show Taken to see exactly how he came to be the person that he is. I don't know if they're still doing it. I wouldn't mind watching it, but it's CBS. But the action is really nice. It's, it's none of that shaky cam stuff that the, the Born Identity movies gave us. It's like none of that. I mean, the hand-to-hand -hand combat, it's none, it's none of that tricky stuff. It's, it's, it's just simple. I'm like, God damn. Like, Liam Neeson is moving so fast and so swift, he is whooping these young dudes' ass. And I mean, he's doing whatever. I mean, there's a scene where he's just torturing a guy. I'm like, oh my God. Like. Homie is not playing. He he is doing what he needs to do. Like, I didn't find no problem with this movie. I didn't find it boring. I didn't find, like, this scene to be, like, oh, why would he do to that stupid? It's like, nothing. I mean, it was a great action movie. It's not none of that generic. It's not the sequels. You know what I'm saying? Like, just stay with the first Taken. The sequels were were bullshit. You know what I'm saying? The first movie is, is great. First movie is great. First movie is all you need. Hell, Liam Neeson's the... Liam Neeson's demeanor, his his build, like he's like 6'2", 6'3", his voice is what makes him, you know, intimidating as shit. I mean, he, you just go up to him. I have a very particular set of skills. Skills that are... Nah, I don't know why I try to do a, an impression of Liam Neeson. I suck at it. Like, I don't really have that much to say about this movie. It's not a bad thing, it's a good thing because it's just so good. If you like an action movie, this is it, you know what I'm saying? It's a serious action movie, you know what I'm saying? I, it's not one of those fun action movies where stuff just happens here and there just because, like, no. Everything has a purpose. Everything, there's a reason behind it. The things that he's doing to get his daughter back, the tactics he's using, you know what I'm saying, his methods are, you know, good. You know what I'm saying? They make sense, and it's it's getting him results. So taking it. If you've seen it, comment down below. Let me know what you think. And remember, if there's a movie that's five years or older that you want me to review every Thursday, just comment down below and let me know. And I will see you next time. Peace.